guys, it's Caitlin Burberth with the Tennis Drill. This week's drill is called Plank Ball. Now, if you can't do a plank, that's okay. I have a modification for that. But what you're gonna need for this drill is you're gonna need at least one tennis ball. You're gonna also need a mat. I don't want you guys sitting on a hard surface or if you have carpet, you gotta watch out for your bum and for your knees. So um, you wanna be sitting on a mat and at least have a ball. And how this works is if you can't get up into a plank, um, I can't fully do a plank. I have to use my knees. So I'm able to kneel a little bit here. So I'm more like on my four corners, like a cat kind of. And all you do, this is my favorite job to do when I was stuck in the hotel, was um, this one. So you just kind of like try and do a little bit of a tap up and you're trying to keep the ball well. Oh, also engaging your abs. Thanks, Izzy. So you're also kind of engaging your core on this one and eye hand coordination, which is really good. So if that you can't if you can't do a plank, that's okay. You can also sit and you can maybe sit a little crisscross applesauce like this. And you can sit and do this drill like this as well. It also really works on our eye-hand coordination. Maybe to make this drill a little bit tougher if you can't do the plank, you could also just do forehand, backhand, just one hand, see if you could do that. The second part of this drill is against the wall. So I would do this in the hotel. So what you can do if you can get in a plank again, and I want to make sure you want to stay on the mat, is you're going to sit. Oh my God! Is you're going to sit like this, and you come up to the wall, the wall, and you're going to try and hit against the wall. And you want to see. If, oops. You want to see if you can use your forehand and backhand. Same thing. If you could do the other side, this side's always weaker for me. Oh. And then if you can't do the plank, you can just sit. You might have to scoot a little bit closer to get there, but if you just sit, you can also do the same thing. You also wanna make sure you let the ball bounce every time after it hits the wall. Let's try that again. And that's plank ball.